Hello, everyone. So, uh, I may have wound up playing, uh, playing MapleStory for the past several days. I did stop to stream Awesome Knots the other day, but otherwise, I have an excuse, though. I had an excuse. There was a, uh, there was like a two times EXP event going on the first day. I, I have no excuse for the other days. I'm going to, uh, actually, I found out something new about it recently. I think it was earlier today I found out that there may be some kind of attempt to make the game a little more like it used to be. A, a bit less suck. So, uh, that's where I'm going to be exploring a little bit today. But before I do that, I have something to show you just real quick. I'm going to pull this up. This is the Boulder Dash. And the Boulder Dash is a goddamn hero. Job advancement? Never needed it. Level 59? And he's a, he's a, he's a beginner. He just all, all he's got is a stolen fence and a uh, li lightsaber I managed to find on the ground. That was, that was a nice find. That's about it, though. He has no skills. He can poke people with the snail skills. That's his only ability. Otherwise, he can, he did, as Duke Nukem would say, skills are for pussies. All he can do is hit stuff with his sword. That enchant stuff. I just, I, he's had to spend everything, all, all of his money, on just souping up all of the worst equipment just to stay kind of somewhat competitive. And yes, I realize it's an incredibly dumb way to play. I just wanted to show it off anyway, because I'm, yeah. But we're not going to play him today. That would be very grindy and boring and not fun to watch. So I'm going to back out of here, and I'm actually going to, uh... I'm going to be playing my main character class. The char I, I'm actually I'm going to be attempting to start over my main character for this game. Which was the uh, Phantom class. That guy. Right there. Him. So we'll see how uh, we're going to see how that goes in the reboot world is the one that we're going to be checking out. Apparently it's part of the new newest patch that's going on. All of these worlds are really just, they're all functionally the same. They're just different servers because, you know, there are so many players that they couldn't all fit onto one. But Reboot is mechanically different. So this was just added. And the Reboot server has some differences in that the monsters are apparently harder to fight. They're all stronger. The, you can, uh, I nev I never got around to professions, which is like crafting and such, in my previous two streams. But normally you can only learn three of the five crafting skills. In Reboot you can learn all five, you're totally self-sufficient. And there are some other things, there are some... It removes a lot of the like enchanting and scrolling, compl unnecessarily complicated stuff. It removes trading between players, which sounds like a big hindrance, but as much as the game got carried away with just turning into a bunch of people, it, it just turned into like a stock market with everyone selling these items that they hacked anyway. So, honestly, that's good to see. It's good to see, uh, it's going to be a very single player experience. It's still an MMO, but I think it's, it's kind of something that this game needed. And I'm gonna try. I'm gonna explore that. We're gonna see if it lives up to what it's gonna, what it's going on. I got my. Uh, I already made the character. I've not started playing him at all, but I did set up the keys off stream, so I already have that taken care of. We don't have to waste stream time on that. Got a good, a uh, good whore name from a good whore self. And I'm gonna dive right in. 
So I do have this my main my main main character, like the one that I've actively tried to play the most in the past was a phantom. And I think he was level 140, the maximum level is 250. But still, that's that's pretty high. That took a lot of hours to work to that level. Oh, you get to see OBS in the corner there. <laughs> oh, it's a, okay. It sends me back to the. Uh, fine, I get. If it's asking me again, I guess we we have to watch it. We get more. Uh, more excessive anime with cheesy English voice acting. They do not get the A-list stars for this game. Phantom. They were too powerful. Uh, who's there? Don't tell me you've been out here waiting for me all night. Shall I summon the Okay, guard? I'm a telepath. My mouth doesn't need to move. I'll not hand over our treasure, no matter how charming you try to be. That actually charming. sounds like Michelle You're Ruff. Coming to your senses. I have invited an envoy from the Black Mage to Arev. Okay, maybe not. I hope to negotiate terms of peace. Michelle Ruff is the voice of Rukia oh, in uh, English Bleach. I don't think they would. Uh, I think any actual anime voice actors are a little above their. Uh, well, not actually, they're not above their budget at all. Uh, above what they'd be, wi they're willing to spend. Nexon is a pretty, pretty greedy company is their their reputation Phantom, you must take the sky you must I, I don't get it. this is already on YouTube I'm sure so there's I, I have no obligation to not talk through this okay now we're on a mysterious airship the Phantom is the uh, one of the hero classes which are like souped up specialized versions of the regular classes, and he is the thief. So, Phantom is the fancy thief class, basically. And he's a very, very technical character. But he's got a lot of perks that uh, kind of. He's a very versatile, very high convenience character. And you know, you know me, I'm a lazy fuck, so high convenience is a great boon for me. So I'm I'm a rich asshole. This is my bedroom. Oh, and I, I'm again I'm forever sing single. Okay. Events. What's this? The burning project. Oh, that's the thing that I did make him the burning character. One burning character for this world, just because I do want to try to. Uh, I am gonna try to, to you know do some leveling with him. I will not be I will not be standing on one map and grinding though so you don't have to worry about uh, that would turn for that would turn from a stream into a pod podcast okay and there's also special stuff that you get for just being on the reboot world days of magic okay I don't know that I I guess that means it's temporary. I only have it for five hours. That is a part of the reason Nexon is notorious for being greedy is that all, most or all cash items, the items you buy with, you know, money money, are stuck to whatever character you're on. You can't change them to other characters and they're, a lot of them are temporary. Hello, Sandy. Twenty million mesos. Jesus Christ. Okay, so I'm, <laughs> I'm going to be. Uh, if I reach level thirty, I'm potentially going to be stupidly rich. Oh, and no okay, two of them. I have two snails. 
I have Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Explorers can exchange cash items. Can they? Alright, I, I was not, I don't, I don't, I never use cash items. I value my money, so I wouldn't, wow, that's a big, I have a lot of expansion slots. I wonder, it must be the, uh, the reboot world lets you have a lot of them. Okay, I can't use that to level 30. Potion to reboot your insides. I get it. Like I said, I did set up the key bindings already, so that's not going to be a... That will be a non-issue. Okay, actually, there is one thing I didn't... Didn't do earlier, and that's... I wonder if it has the, uh... Oh, there's a special skill. Meso drop amount times five. Okay, is that... That's passive, so... Yeah, you just get a shit ton of, uh... Of cash dropping in this world. And boss equipment drop rate. Oh, that's another difference, is that monsters will only drop equipment for your class. They will not drop... Like, normally they drop just any random number of things, but since I'm in the thief category, I'm not... The monsters I kill won't drop warrior things. Let me know if you have any questions. I'm one of the top errands in Cradia. Oh, You're really revealing your nerd here, Sandy. <coughs> <coughs> You've invested a lot more time in this game than I have, then, because I... That 140 Phantom was my highest character ever, and now I'm restarting him. Okay, I'm going to, uh... I'm going to Reeve this Cygnus Knight's place. I, uh, sure, why not? Let's do an infiltration. <laughs> I don't remember too much of the Phantom's, like, introductory missions here. I think there is some uh, cutscene stuff we have to get through. <laughs> it's I know it's not nearly as long as intro as a uh, as the psychic person, the kinesis. Which, by the way, I did kind of lose interest in. Who knew that playing as like a, a cocky fuck who has to be white and sometimes male is gets boring. Okay, we. I, I remember this. We open with a with a stealth section. <laughs> okay. So I can. Uh, I can use stealth, and what what were those commands? Delete and end. Okay. So I can use stealth, and I can throw money at guards to distract them. <gasps> How long? Stealth is very short. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. Okay, I... Can I do anything now? If he touches me, I'm down. Can I sneak past? As long as he doesn't touch me, I'm okay, right? Oh no, he, he lost sight of me, okay. <gasps> I vaguely remember this. Isn't this exciting? I mean, at least I can get through this fairly quickly compared to most intros. Just go through some uh, Sly Cooper kind of stuff. Alright, get over here. <clears throat> Come on, you mustached asshole. Oh, right, I can't walk through them with that. That'll do. 
is a little going a little bit slowly. So the uh, Phantom, the Phantom, what makes him unique is that he can actually steal the skills of other classes, like other players that you'd randomly encounter. So I am going to have to go for a uh, go on a manhunt. God damn it! Wasn't speed enough. This would be so much easier if I should, if I could just shank a bitch. Now, of course, I can't jump down. That would be also too easy. Nope. Speed run. I get through. Nope. Too speedy. He can't see me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Made it. Okay. But I'm not going to make that one. God damn it. Like, this throw cash thing is useless. I haven't been able to do anything with it yet. Okay, we're good. <clears throat> okay, so I just... The chief knight was no issue. I, I just was able to make it... Oh, no, I have a, I have a hood now. I'm su Suddenly, I'm an a Assassin's Creed character. Pretty much only get to steal one. You get to steal one of each uh, each skill level, like first, second, third, and fourth of job job advancement. You can steal more than one, but you can have one active at at a time, and it is useful to keep more than one. I have I have a record of what I, I'm planning to get. Holy symbol. That's the one that increases uh, exp gain, right? Some new royal lady. I'm sure this all this story is making sense to you know, those of you who have never played the game before. All phantoms take that one. Yeah, that's, de that's on my list. That is definitely one that I had active most of the time. Generally, the uh, clerics, bishops, the white mage group are the ones that have the best uh, <clears throat> best abilities to steal. Oh, I can skip the tutorial. What? Fine. I guess I shouldn't. Okay. Oh, god damn it. I think is this going to be a uh this is going to be like a long this is going to be a long chat cut scene. Okay, I'm skipping this. Look, it's the Wizard uh, Wizard of Oz. Oh, the Wizard of Oz, right? The Yeah, Fire Fire Lady. Und nine heart. I know that, boy, anyone trying to read this is going to have to pause their video a lot. I know that uh, you, can, you can copy the skills of any Explorer class, except for, I think there, there are exceptions. I think the Zen, like the, the Samurai classes, are out, and... Uh, What's it? The Cannoneer, I'm not sure about. That's like a special pirate class. And the Jet, also a special pirate class, is, I think, out.
the individual storylines don't really mean anything to me. Yeah, I agree. They're very unnecessary. And honestly, kind of interfere with the actual gameplay. Get I, well, hold on. I said I saw Gaston. Oh, there's a video. Okay. More anime. Everyone, how long will we let this frail child play at being our empress? It's Maple Story, your own story. Yeah, that's what it was supposed to be, and, and then they decided I that they were just going to start writing the stories for this you. Is Skaya, the lost jewel of Empress Arya. Oh, okay, so Arya Arya's the dead empress. I am the true heir to Arev. What is that guy doing? What? <laughs> Coming to this, like, royal event wearing an e like, that looks like something you'd wear when you were sleeping so that you'd fool people into thinking you weren't sleeping. The eye mask. First, there's the bloodline. Empress Arya had no children. Only a niece. You, on the other hand, are trying to pass yourself off as something you're not. Who dares question me? I don't. I. I. I'm not questioning anymore. I'm just. I'm just along for the fucking ride. Her frailty is proof she's absorbing Jinsu's power. And finally, you claim to hold the treasure of Arev. Apparently, looking on the bottom screen, the Resistance folks. There, apparently, there's a new uh, Resistance class they added as well. That was. They finally added a Warrior branch. Phantom out of hiding. Still no thief though. Of these lies, how can we believe? It's Batman's sidekick trying to make the big leagues. <coughs> Set aside your parlor tricks. The real Skaya is safe. Because they had the, uh, the resistance class had In the... the of Phantom. The, uh... What's it? The Wild Hunter for Bowman. It had the Battle Mage for the magician, Magicians. It had the, uh... What was it? Mechanic was the name of the guy... In a robot suit Are we going to keep for pirates. Game, Hela? Didn't have a warrior thief, but they finally added a warrior one, and it's like a, uh, it's like a, a brawler with a with a hand, arm cannon or something, is what it is. I don't know. I might try that off stream at some point in the near future, but uh, why don't you show the good people your true colors? I wanted to try out the reboot you server today and see what that. Me? God, this is taking a while. Yep, she's evil. Okay. Suddenly skeletons. Fine. I'll let you keep your child empress for a while longer. The demon No, 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 not the demon avenger. That's not what I'm talking about. They uh the demon avenger and also and the uh what is it? Xenon are technically in the uh you know, in the Edelstein resistance categories. But uh no, the uh there's a new there's a new one that's just a regular no special storyline one along with the three original ones is blaster and now that's the warrior branch is he's got like a one, one arm has like a missile launcher on it the other one is like a like a steam hammer I mean from the sound of it his skills seem his skills seem kind of fun they look pretty brutal like he can grab enemies and hurl them into the ground with his fists, not with some sissy psychic powers, by the way. There really wasn't, it just really wasn't very satisfying to play as the psychic character. It was a very generic set of abilities, none of them really stood out. <laughs> no, I hadn't heard about it, so if you're curious, you can look up the, the blaster class, Sandy. I better give them what they want. Okay, are we done? Can we play the game now? Yep, that's me. I'm the Phantom. I got my Sailor Moon airship all ready to go. Kind of intro real hero needs. Okay, sure. Okay, and I got a I got a badge now. They need to just make an anime and leave the actual game out of this cutscenes. You mean the cutscenes out of the game? Yeah, I, I, I don't disagree. 
An actual anime with actual voice acting would be, would be nice. Oh, Gaston. That's that's my assistant. I my assistant is named Gaston. I forgot about that. No one can serve my master like Gaston. Oh yeah, I don't get to see see that illusion of choice there. Where I got to pick a response, but there was only one possibility. <clears throat> oh, I'm already level ten. Okay, we just skip. There's no actual training. They just go straight from one to ten after the intro. I guess that's suitable payment for the long ass cutscene. Oh, uh, so yeah, this this is the this is the rich fuck character. Like, he already starts as this this super legendary dude who has his own airship and everything. This is the home base. And what that's another convenient thing about him, other than the skill copying things, is that uh, he can return here anytime and fly to any point in Maple World. So, it's free airfare. Because you don't get rich by spending money. Oh, I used to be level 250, but the Black Mage cursed me. Okay. Hmm. Do I have another choice? No? Okay, I have to say this. Okay, I do have to go to the training center. I have to fight the terrifying orange mushroom. Okay. Nope, don't gotta think about stats, just all luck. Babby mode. Okay, I'm not- there's no point in leveling this up yet, because I'm not gonna be able to, uh... I guess I should. So that when I actually get out of here, I can steal immediately. What else is here? What's the, uh... I have Shroud Swalk? Sh shroud Swalk? Squawk! Okay, the... The Phantom... I'm actually gonna assign these because the Phantom has some special stuff that he ends up using to uh, manage his stolen skills. So I'll be doing that later when I'm actually, you know, in the world and can steal things. But for now, I'll just... Uh... Stick one on that. And I want to have... The... I want to be absolutely sure this one is ready for uh, when I can actually steal skills. Because if you steal a skill... You're limited to whatever level your stealing skill is at. God damn it. So if I were to if my steal ability was at like level 14 and I tried to steal a skill at level 20, I could still st steal it, but I wouldn't get I wouldn't get the full skill. It would only be at level 14 and I'd just have to later find someone else and copy it again to get the level 20 version. So I want it maxed out and ready as soon as possible. Alright, let's go, uh... Oh, I forgot to set my, uh... Here. Oh, we got... Desert music. Again, no one ever uses their default attack. It's always the skills, or your... Okay, I actually don't do much without the skill. Mmm, 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 slow down. It's always the skill is your default I, that you use practically, so. Oh, no, I actually am fighting the orange mushrooms. I thought th that was a joke. I thought they would be, like, sub-level 10 monsters. Oh, by the way, I figured out that, uh, that monster collection, that second best bestiary thing, is that, uh, it is a second collection. That's the original one. That's the classic bestiary, the Crusader Codex. But this is the monster collection, and you'll, uh, You'll get entries just randomly as you're fighting that particular monster, and that's for the whole world. 
Like, if I were to create another character in this reboot world, they would have all the entries that this guy has. And you get prizes for filling up, you know, certain amounts of the of the bestiary. So that's nice. I actually, honestly, the collection aspects, the bestiaries, both of them are a big part of the reason I still play this game, like at all, because I, I, I I'm super organized OCD and I love to collect things. So basically, I'm not playing this because it's Maple Story. I'm playing this because it's Pokemon. You have to pick up their card. You have to pick them up for the classic bestiary. Not this one. Not the new one. The new one happens automatically. Just You'll get a random notification after you fight, you know, just fight the monsters. Nope. Get out of here. Fuck off. So I'm, I'm, I'm rich as balls. I have my own airship. But that, that says nothing about my pockets. I still have to earn my money from zero. I, I have no I have no allowance from Gaston. Gaston is whoring all my funds to himself. I spent my I got I allotted a fortune and I spent it all on this airship. I've got like a, a trust fund stowed away to pay all of my manservants. Hey, she's cute. But that's it. I have no I have no spending money left. Where are you? Come here. Here. You shall be Mega Shroom. Another new Super Mario Brothers power-up. I do like the, uh... The familiar system actually used to be a lot shittier. Okay, I have to be level 33 to open that. Yeah, the familiars used to be, like cash items, temporary. Like, if your your familiars would have a limited lifespan, and you could still boost their power by getting, you know, up to three cards, but once that ran out, you would have to go and hunt the cards again. Which is fine for, like, the, uh, the junior boogies, the little mana balls that I used. Because they're pretty easy to get. They're fairly common. But if you had, like, a rare familiar, and that ran out, I mean, that was kind of... It kind of defeated the point of collecting them if they were temporary like that. Level 240. Okay. Not not 250. I'd lowered my ambitions since the last time we talked. I'm gonna level up again. I'm going through this fast. Thanks to the burning thing. I want a pink bean familiar. That would be difficult to get. I've never actually I've never actually gotten far enough to fight pink bean. I think I have gotten strong enough to fight regular Zaku once. That's like the highest. Da how I assign skills. Okay, there we go. That's that's maxed out already. Okay, that's my double jump. I've beaten it, but it didn't drop. Yeah, familiars are fairly rare to get on high-level monsters. More than fairly rare. They're very rare. I right, get this out of here. I don't need any of that. That's a big criticism for this game, is the uh, interface. Is that a lot of really unnecessary windows, a lot of really obtuse ways to get to screens and edit things. And it could just, it could be so much more streamlined. Oh, he wants me to click it. Okay. Cash for levels. So I'm literally, I'm literally buying my way past training. Level 70. Okay, well, it got me three levels up. Can I keep doing it? It didn't disappear.
Okay, so I could use it three times. That, that was kind of cool. Le <laughs> Remember how, how I ended like the, la the first video at level 20-something? And just like that, I was able to buy my way to it without even spending my money. Only level 18. Well, no, not quite. They didn't account for the burning aspect. Okay, I gotta go fight the other thing. Luck and dexterity are both important for thieves. Yeah, and nah, no. Nah. I don't think that was true even when the character was released. Like, at, when the Phantom came out was after they'd already done the whole just throw everything onto one stat thing. Like, luck is also my aim. There's no point in building anything else. Okay, there we go. And I have a, a weak double jump now. Okay, so this is a... Uh, I guess this is like a set considered a separate... Almost like a separate client from the regular game. Because it's not showing that I have either of these. And the, the Blessing of the Fairy and Empress's Blessing are supposed to be equal to the highest... Highest level character on your account. And they're both showing zero, so I guess... You know, Reboot World is just totally separate. I'm gonna be doing this a little longer than the... Uh, slow down. Mm -mm, slow down. Don't worry, that jump will get better as I level it up. I'm gonna be doing this a little longer than the previous two streams because... You know, I do wanna... I wanna give this new thing, this new world, a, a good... a good test out. Oh, yes. I need these. These. The, if the orange mushrooms dropped familiars, then these guys should drop them too. And these are the, the these are the guys I need for uh, familiars. Yup, there they are. My portable mana ball. Wow, this is really convenient that they put these monsters in here. Oh, and just a kill everything pulse happens when you level up. This phantom guy is kind of a kind of a bitch. If he's complaining about how long it takes to level right now, he's in for a lot of he's in for a crappy experience when he gets to the higher levels. And he has to sit grinding on one map for like a week on end. Oh, I have lower EXP gain. God damn it. Large amount of MP. That's what I need. Jari 10, for those of you. I guess I never explained it the last stream either. That's an Urusei Yatsura character. That was uh, Rumiko Takahashi's first series. That was the person who wrote uh, Inuyasha. It's the most famous one. The series that she did before that was Ranma 1 half, and the series she did before Ranma was Urusei Atsura. And that never got dubbed, that never made it to the West, so, uh. Which is kind of a shame. It's a really, uh. Better series than Ranma, I would say. That's a fun, goofy thing. I guess I could, I'd better. better upgrade my stuff. Okay. You know, setting aside this, uh. The whole debuff. That skull effect is pretty cool. Miser Mastery. Alliteration aside, I think Miser has some kind of negative connotations to be using here. Okay, that was a big boost. Ow. <clears throat> okay, I need to. Uh, I need my buddy. I need my mana ball. 
out and ready. I don't know what the red background means, if that's supposed to mean it's like a rare thing or what. Oh, and I got a, I got a stick. I got a no, that is a noble stick. A female, female, a lot of, a lot of female clothing. <laughs> I just, I just rifled, I just rifled a bunch of chick's clothes. I don't need anything for myself, Phantom's just a pervert. Okay, Gaston, what's your next thing for me? No need for all the grandstanding, Gaston. Obviously, my Phantom does not understand Gaston. Although, apparently, by the look of him, Gaston's really chilled out over the years. Lost a lot of that muscle tone. Okay, Christian. Oh, of course, also Phantom the player. All the, all his staff except for Gaston are women. Something, something, fashion trends for evil. Okay, I got, I got a disguise hat. Okay, okay, so I'm going to... I'm going to Edelstein? Oh, oh okay. I, whatever, I'm along for the ride. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm leveling up so fast with this. Like, it's not even worth getting better equipment, because I'm just gonna outgrow it... immediately. Shopping for Phantom is like shopping for baby clothes. By the time you get around to it, it's already too late. Okay, I, I'm supposed to go here. I'm supposed to go to Edelstein. That is a good tutorial. It tells you what all you're capable of. It shows you the airship that you can use to go off everywhere. Yeah, don't mind my fabulous gold, uh, gold clothing. I'm, I'm totally a member of the of the evil Nazi group. The Maple Nazis, they're called. I'm not here. Okay. Oh, I got I got notifications. What are these? Mr. Lee's airline bits inventory. Why not? Free EXP. You like that, uh, you like that shitty xylophone? More free EXP. These quests have been in the game forever. They're kind of, they're not, like, they're, they exist to inform players of new systems that aren't new anymore. Okay, tell me about how the beauty salon works. Oh, uh, sure, I will take the, uh, I'll take the hair coupon. How long does that last? Do I have to use it right away? 8.24. Yeah, I have until tomorrow to use it. How do I get to the... I, don't, I should have listened. I don't know how to get to the salon screen and save my hair and face. Okay, where am I going? What am I doing?
Okay, equips. I'm glad someone who knows how to do this shit's here, Sandy. There we go. I actually do want to get new, uh, new hair and such, but I'm actually, I'm not going to take the time to look through all of them. I'm, I'm, I would have to, like, I would have to open my browser and look at all of the maple styles and decide which one I want, because you, if you don't get what you want with this one, then you end up having to, you know, pay cash monies for, uh, more. So, I will do that later off stream, is I will, you know, do the custom character design. You get a random one? Are you sure it's random? Tutorial hair, tutorial face. Okay, the one you get from Tot in the those tutorials is not random. Maybe this one is, though. I don't know. Where's... Where are you, big headward? Where's the hair salon? Do I just use it? Is that it? Yep, it is random. Okay. Okay, what? let's see what travesty I look like now. Okay. O o okay, I turned into, uh... I turned into Kahlua. Just angry, angry Kahlua. Whatever, I guess I'll... Guess I'll save these. Oh god, it costs a hundred thousand mesos to change. Well, oh well. Bob Barker. Come on down! I guess it's a little Bob Barker. Well, now I want to wear the hat, so I guess that's that suits me. No, you get... You get ones that you can choose your hairstyle from uh, Tot. So I will do that later off stream and get a more fitting hairstyle. Okay, she lo she lost her ring. This is the this is the Nazi whore of the group. She's uh she's fucking all the Nazis. And I can't imagine with any anything other than a Brooklyn accent. Because this is my main character, I will be trying to fill out, you know, the bestiary, bestiary, and all that too, but... I don't know, maybe I'll do that off-stream. Maybe I'll, I'll wait for that. Garish Ring. Why did she say Patrol, Patrol Robot S? Oh no, it's... Patrol robot, so just these guys. Mm, mm, slow down. You'd think these 2D sprites were too much for a game to handle. Well, that was easy. How are the levels, by the way? Is the game audio too low, Sandy? I should have checked that earlier. All perfectio, okay. Okay, on to other Watchmen. What does Yamamoto want? Or fake? Uncle Uncle Pennybags, the, monop the Monopoly dude in a tall maple style.
What do you mean I might be one of them? You think I'm a Nazi? In this outfit? Yamamoto rips off his shirt. Yeah, he don't don't let the don't let the dapper look fool you. He's buff as hell under there. So no, that's the Pringles guy. Yeah, he did. They, they both have. They they look pretty similar. I I could believe that like the Pringles guy and the Monopoly guy are related. Maybe the Pringles guy is the Monopoly guy's son. Maybe the Pringles guy is like the family disappointment. I mean, he he is like a, a cultural icon, but he never made it. He wasn't quite the tycoon. That the uh, the Monopoly guy was. I should be. Re I really should be reading these. Streetlight bulb. Okay. Actually, because I'm sure they're not going to send me back to the low monsters. I'm going to fill them out real quick. My OCD is is very demanding. Do, 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 do. Feel the frost. Now that guy's got his hair in order. Did that thing really not die? Okay, there we go. I'm just waiting for when you get the monster in the in the new bestiary, you get like a message on the screen that'll tell you with unnecessarily fancy, you know, game crashing animation. This guy, this this will be this will be Buddy. This will be his name. Normally, I would be more conservative with my magic, but I have no reason to be, because I have an infinite ma magic ball here. There it goes. Oh, that's something that might be of slight value. Oh, Lolica armor. Nope, wrong one. And now he's in there. Don't have have your abilities? What do you- No, I have my abilities, I just- I thought, hey, I'll be conservative and I'll just stab this one, but there's really no reason for me to be conservative. Uh, you get the, uh, you get the regular character-specific bestiary entries, the little cards that pop out a lot a lot more readily than you do the, you know, the world entries. Thankfully, the entries happen pretty fast with, you know, low-level enemies like these, so it doesn't take a long time. Plus, I can fill out, uh, you know, familiars that I'm never going to use while I'm at it. I, I like collecting things. Sue me. And you... You'll be, uh... Bloomer. You know, like the Dragon Ball character. Everyone... That... That... that chick that everyone was masturbating to when they were 12. Bloomer. Actually her Japanese name. There was some odd uh, R to L quote unquote mistranslations in Dragon Ball between well like Krillin and Bulma are the two major ones. From uh, Kuririn and Buruma. All right, come on, you assholes. Give me your entry. I would also be picking this stuff up if I weren't so... Actually, you know what? 
I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be greedy. Because these, uh, these pets will automatically pick stuff up, up for you, which is nice. It's really convenient. Because even just trying to pick stuff up can make this game lag. DBZ made me the opposite of anything horny. Oh, did, didn't you know it was actually it was actually a love series? I don't know if you picked up on that. The a, the action was just a very subtle undertone in the Dragon Ball franchise. You know, Goku X Bulma forever. Oh, come on. I see, I see the slowdown, and it gets me hopeful. Oh, I see equipment. I should be getting that stuff. The Phantom... The Phantom is in the thief category, so he does wear thief equipment, so maybe I will get to actually look like a ninja. But for now, I'll probably just end up looking like a thug. Yeah, I don't... I'll just have the, uh, I'll trade out my weak as hell platinum suit for just a, a vest. Just a vest. No pants, don't need pants. Now I'm totally inconspicuous, except I still have the, I still have the cape on. I'm, <laughs> I look like Eminem wearing like a, a pirate captain cape. Or Eminem trying to be a superhero for a day. For the longest time, I thought Frieza, Frieza was a crotchety old lady. He he sounded like one. He was, in fact, voiced by an old lady. Linda Young was not so spry by the time DBZ came, ar came around. In fact, in the first... I think the first Funimation production she was in was Yu Yu Hakusho. Well, no, DBZ was there. DBZ was their first ever production, but one of the earliest ones she was in was Yu Yu Hakusho, and she was just the iconic old lady character in that. So you have Frieza smoking cigarettes and telling Yusuke what an asshole he is. It was pretty, a pretty great series. This is taking longer than anticipated. At least I have DBZ to talk about. That's about all I can say for this. I spent... That's how I got the... Uh, actually, that's how I did a lot of leveling on the uh, Boulder Dash character. Was, uh... You know, just going around and filling out the... Monster collection. But that was on a different world, so that... Unfortunately, does not carry over here. That's okay, though. I, I don't mind. I want to, uh... Again, trying out the whole reboot thing. The Boulder Dash thing was... Oh, and they got little... I don't know what, what those have to do with anything. They're like little XP balls that will just spawn after you've been on a map for a certain amount of time, too. Uh, the Boulder Dash was a, a running gag between not not me and Jack. That was actually from uh, before I'd met Jack with an old friend of mine. I, I've mentioned him on stream a couple times as Road Rocket. And he was basically just some idiot who thought he was a superhero and would go around trying to save the day. And fucking things up in the process. That was the character of the Boulder Dash. And so now he's my, uh, he's my permanude character. Okay, I'm gonna give this just another minute or two, and it still is not... If it's still not happening, if we're still getting this unlucky, I'm just gonna move on with the actual quests. I've never had this take this long for monsters this week before. They usually fill in really fast.
Zelrog, we should hang out this week. I have a lot of days off. Oh, we could. I have a... Oh, what are we doing? On uh, Friday, we're doing... Uh, I'm doing stuff with Jack. Jack is going to be... Uh, Jack is probably going to be busy for his weekend. We're going out on Friday, but other than that, he's going to be uh, probably job searching. And maybe we'll do be able to fit a stream in on Saturday or something. We'll see what happens. But no, uh, no definitive, no 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 definitive Jack time as of yet. We could see if maybe something on a uh, Friday or something. I'll, I'll talk to Jack. I think we could do like, uh, what do you think, like Smash Brothers or something, Sandy? Okay, one more loop around, that's it. This is the last run. The last hoorah. Nope. Well, that's disappointing. Alright, well, back to quests then. Mmm. Mmm, -mm, slow down. Feel the frost still just uh, hanging out underneath the tree. I think he just, he just created that account just to get that particular hair and stand there looking cool. Also, super unnecessary, extravagant sparkle effects, ho. Whoops, didn't mean to intrude. That was not where I was trying to go. There we go. Oh, I have to talk to uh, this guy, I guess. Uh, <laughs> Kira, Izuru Kira from Bleach, I have to talk to. <laughs> Officer Bell, okay. I don't want to talk about the Black Wings right now. Oh yeah, I'm one of the Black Wings. You see this hat? This is a- don't, don't let the style fool you. This is an official Black Wings Nazi hat. We'll figure something out, Sandy. I'll, uh, I'll talk to Jack when he gets up in a little bit, and I'll talk to you after the stream. We can figure something. In fact, I'm probably going to be going to Awesome Knots after this in a little while. Maybe another hour of Maple Story. Okay, I'm almost, almost to level 30. Almost got this maxed. Oh no, I'm, I'm down for it. I just, we keep saying we're gonna do it and we never get around to it. I'm, just, I'm on the roof. I didn't know I could get up here. I am the knight. I watch over this city and its Nazis from my rooftop perch with angst. Uh. It's enough Phantom Batman for now. Sounds like it, those things sound like dying elephants. And background blimps. Yeah, the, the, you have to have the background bl blimps in order to look, you know, fully cool standing up there. I'm just, yep, I'm killing signs. At some point, they kind of started to get, like, uncreative with the monsters. And it was just, okay, the, the new location is a city. Let's take just, like, 
objects that you would find in or near cities and uh, their monsters. They didn't really capitalize too much on the whole... I mean, the whole Edelstein setting is like all steampunk, which is neat, but they didn't really capitalize on that with the monsters. They're just random objects, like planted... They've got plants and street signs and telephone poles. Oh, I got a title. Adventure Bound. What's that? That's for being online for a certain amount of time, but... I think that's the... I have to, like, talk to a monk to get that medal. Uh-oh. Game? There we go. Okay. Okay, just stay logged on. I, I got it. I'll use that later. Actually, I don't think... I don't think you can actually... Uh, that's one of the things about the reboot server, is that normally you can collect these and use them to enchant things. Like I did on the Boulder Dash character earlier. But not here. You don't use those for enchanting. In fact, their only purpose is that you can sell them in shops for a decent amount. So, uh... How do street signs even reproduce? Uh... Well, first they need to get wood. And then they may obviously build more signs. A very splintery process. That is a, a question, is like a lot of how the... Uh, you know, honestly, I'm not going to talk too much about this, but uh, one of the things that happens every time I come back to playing this game for a little while, something that always happens is that, like, I think this thing has so much potential if it were just executed better, without all of the mistakes that Nexon makes. And I've had the idea myself for a uh, for a 2D MMO. A less, a less crappy one. And I, I just, I, I always, I flesh it out over and over again, but it never, you know, because I have no si substantial background in game design, I can't really do anything with the idea. I've thought about actually kickstarting it recently, but we'll, uh, I don't know, it's still, it's not likely. Would be cool, though. I have a, I have a neat, setting and mechanics and everything laid out would be fun but for now i'll just i'll just have to stick to rpg maker what am i doing oh i got the 50 what what am i doing i was not even paying attention oh wow i got a lot of a lot of those things that i don't need Uh, did I fill them up? Yeah, I did. Okay, he's got all the familiars. Okay. Aww. Well, why, why isn't there like a 12 character limit on the box then? Why don't you just tell me before I type the whole thing in? Okay. There we go. That'll work. Zelrog, do you have Smash Brothers on the N64? I do, but my Nintendo 64 is in storage. I put that and most of the, uh... Actually, I put all of my cartridge systems away. And, uh, switched to ROMs just because bit rot was happening. I'm sure it would still work. But, I, you know, I'd have to get it out and everything. Being a black wing means re being a real think. It means kidnapping innocent women and tearing people's lives apart. Being a black wing means being a scumbag. I'm into that kind of thing. Okay, so he's he's the self-loathing Nazi. 
Where am I going? I gotta go to the other. Nazi number three. There we go. McDonald's Nazi. I'm not- I haven't been wearing the hat for ages. They still just immediately trust me as a black wing. Okay, come on, game. You can do it. Go get the item he wants. Okay, where? Where am I supposed to... Get it? Huh? It doesn't tell me that. Okay, serpent. I gotta go kill more things. Did I sign those? I did, okay. Maybe I should have, should have seen what that uh, frost guy was. Maybe I could have stolen something from him. Actually, I should have seen what that person with the fancy effects was. God damn it, I missed some opportunities there. In fact, why am I not on channel 1? I should really be on channel 1 where the most people are. And where the game is most likely to crash. You know, you just gotta try it a few times. This game is kind of a buggy mess. I need to get my mana ball back out. Wrong one. I wonder if I can go straight up with this jump. There we go. Nope, only side to side. Another blue hat. And a gun. The Negotiator. Is this blue hat special in any way? Nope, just... Oh, mine... The one I was wearing had potential. I should have checked that. What is it? Okay, just extra magic defense. And no nothing I'm going to be fighting has magic right now anyway. Just flying through the air. Graceful as a uh, superhero Eminem can be. Alright, I'm gonna check my, uh... Check the folks in town, see if there's anything... Anything I might want. I think I see two people over there. Who's that? That's a wild hunter, okay. Okay, I gotta find another trail to chase. I don't know where that trail is, I'm just gonna... Okay, there it is, that's the... I am the trail. Where are the... Where are the people at? Oh, those are... Not people, those are also NPCs. Where? Okay. Can I not see other people on the minimap? Okay, I gotta go back and talk to the fat guy. I use my mini-map in simple mode. I don't know what the, uh, I don't remember what the difference is. Just 
sell all this stuff. My platinum suit, only worth one meso. Get rid of all these useless familiar cards. I really wish they stacked, or at the very least that they didn't keep, uh, keep picking up after you had the maximum number of familiars, or orbs, or whatever, for that type of familiar. Just one meso pop. That's all they are. I don't remember my inventory. It has to be with the reboot server. You just get a huge inventory too, though. Which I guess makes sense because another thing that is disabled on this server is, uh, for the most part, trading between char your own characters. Because on other servers you can do it so that you can put items, like say I found a cool non-thief item, like a warrior item. I could hang on to that and put it into storage and then take it out as another character, a warrior character, that could use it. I don't think you can do that on Reboot, though. I read that they that's disabled. I'm not entirely sure why. I guess it's because, you know, the idea is the character's supposed to be totally self-sufficient. Oh, wow, those are worth a lot. 5,000 apiece. Displays sustainable platforms. Oh, there's a person. That's a demon character, though, not... Not someone I can copy. I gotta go to a place that has a lot of people, like the, uh, can I go in here yet, or do I have to be level 30? I can. Okay. This will have people. This is a good hub to go to, to, uh... Okay, how full is this gonna be? How game-crashing is this? Okay, I can't copy her. Who's down here? Anyone? Wow, this is really empty for channel 1. Like, you'd ex Normally, there would be huge crowds here. There's someone. Blade Master. I don't know if I can... That, I think that's a, uh... I think that's a thief. Let's see. Oh, there it is. That's what I want. Well, one of the ones I want. There are actually a few, but that's... You know, one of them. I also want haste, but this one does not have haste. Okay. I'll have to find another thief for that. Okay, but that'll be useful to have. Okay, so I just stole that. And then that replaces the skull that I had it on. I'll just put that... Yeah, I'll be right there. Okay. And now? And now I can use that. And I have my bullshit infiltrate places I'm underleveled for skill. Okay, who are she? who's she? Blaze Wizard. Can I use her? Uh... I can. I'll wait, though. I want to... I'm, I'm OCD. I need to get my skills in a certain order. For the most part, I usually keep this one equipped anyway. On the first... I like to have my, uh... My dark sight. Oh, and I can still use my jumping with it. So I can move quickly while invisible. Legend. I don't know what that is. Okay, fat man, what do you got for me? Okay, I gotta go east to Stefan. This is really nice. I can just go through huge areas of monsters without having to worry. Hmm. 
Who's she? What is she? She be oh, get over here. Oh, she's she's that new one. She's the blaster. The new uh renegade. Or not renegade, uh What's it? Resistance class, the warrior one. That has I mentioned like the uh the missile launcher and the steam hammer arm or whatever. Okay, what are you, honey? Get stop moving. Wild hunter. Dawn warrior. Okay. I'll probably have to uh I don't want to bore the stream with it, but I'll have to come back that come back here sometime in the future and get all these monster entries. That's okay though. I'll I'll have plenty of time off stream. I'm not going to if I streamed this all the time I played it, this the stream would be nothing but Maple Story. And that'll that'll die off. I'll 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 play keep playing it for a while and then I'll lose interest in a couple weeks and it'll drop off for another several months again. Okay, I need batteries from these guys. Oh, and I got a... That was a new feature somewhat recently, is that just randomly these giant versions of the monsters will appear. Magic resistant. Okay, well I don't use magic, so that's fine by me. I just, I, I smack people with a cane, that's all I do. So I'm destroying Blackwing machines. I'm destroying Nazi machines to collect batteries for a Nazi. Okay, get that all the way up. All the way to level 30. We're gonna get the second, second advancement. Phantom works fast. Okay, I guess I'll just, I'll come back here later. I'm gonna come back here later anyway, so... I'm just gonna... Just gonna magically teleport into, into the sky. I just... I can do that whenever I want to, if the plot demands it. I have plot powers. I'm raiding my own old vault. I'll just buy a new lo ow. Okay, yeah, I actually do just have to beat the lockdown. Okay. If it works, it works. I don't know why the lock hurt me. I guess it's electrified or something. It's telling me to click there, so I'm guessing I should click there. I don't have to search, search the room. That would be much too challenging. That, that, that would, you know, be gameplay if I had to actually, you know, find where the thing was. Okay. Well, that was also a very fast job advancement.
Yep, not a mesa that I can take. Piles on the floor, all mine. Just gonna leave them. You are not first job. Okay. So I can't click that anymore. I'm not allowed to click things. I have graduated to stage two superhero M&M. That means... Normally, I think that's what I would upgrade first, is the calling card is his new go-to attack. But, again, I want to have the memory so I can copy already. There we go. Okay. Where's the... I should have been checking this before. Where's Tot? Tot? No? Do I not... Do I not have access to Tot person? Okay. I guess I can't, uh... I guess I can't access Tot's know-how. I guess that's not available in uh, the reboot world. I don't think it's because I'm a phantom. I'm not sure, though. Sure, whatever. I don't... Fake cash. I'm just trying to get rid of these little icons. I don't... You can't never get rid of all of them. I don't know that... Nope. They're just... They're just there to open and close windows. Again, really unintuitive, unnecessary, complicated UI. So I'm not going to be able to... Uh, normally the TOTS thing, the know-how, will uh, get you... It will get you uh, free equipment boxes at every like ten levels or something, but I don't get I don't get to do that. Okay, there we go. I need that so that I can set that to auto. I don't know why it's set to manual by default, but uh, that's something that is going to be happening now that I'm level thirty. Is that sometimes I'll get. Uh, like extra effects while I'm attacking. <coughs> oh god, they're strong. Yeah, I forgot that they uh they put the the job advancement here, but they also since they did that, they buffed the monsters immensely. Thankfully, I have my bullshit get out of jail free card. But holy shit, that was a lack of foresight. If I didn't, if I hadn't stolen that ability, I would really have to like sneak my way out of here without taking any monster damage. Where am I? Where am I going? Not this way. Get me out of here. Thankfully, this lasts a, quite a while, the invisibility thing. So it's very useful for uh, sneaking around like an asshole. Nope. Saved myself. Got the Alphonse brothers over there. I'm gonna check one more time for a uh, another thief. I guess I should go to uh, like Kerning or something, the thief city. Nope, just the same people. Oh, but I can uh, I can learn things now. No, do I have to be level 35? Okay, little more. 
You have a super snail. I can still see you. Yeah, that's true. I do have a, uh, I do have a snail and a little uh, fake oni following me around. All right. Well, if I can't, uh, actually, I should probably set this to a skill too. Might as well. There we go. To the skies! Why would I ever spend money on traveling? Honestly, it's a wonder you don't see more phantoms around. I guess because it's so technical a class. Okay, I am actually going to finally upgrade my, uh, my weapon. I can't afford to upgrade anything else, but, I mean, it'll be nice to have more attack power. Okay, that's... Why am I not wearing this? This is objectively better than the beanie. What the hell are you doing on my ship? Get out of here! No, 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 this is, this is my personal airship. This isn't for all phantoms, this is just for me. Motherfucker. Well, that kind of ruins the illusion, doesn't it? There is, in fact, a rabbit loose on my ship. Reef Sky, I, I, where am I going? Alright, I'm going back to, uh... I will continue my battery hunting quest for the time being. So I got, the first stream I spent, I was Jininja Ninja, and I actually got to run around, you know, Victoria Island, Maple World. The second stream, I tried out the Psychic class, and I spent the whole fucking time in contemporary Code Geass Death Note anime land. I didn't actually get into Maple World until the very end of the stream. And this time I'm going to all these exotic places other than, you know, Victoria Island. I'm not going to make it there. I mean, I guess I could, but I mean, there's nothing... Honestly, right, right now... I have quests to do here, so I might as well do that. The only reason I would go to, uh, Victoria, the main island, is to, uh, you know, go monster hunting. I, I would go, I would go play Monster Hunter and get things. The, there is a, uh, there is a great familiar to have opposite of the, uh, what are you? Blaster. Okay. A great familiar to have opposite of the uh, little mana ball, the junior boogie there, is the uh, the snail boss, the first boss in the game that I fought on the first stream. Was a m mono, mano, whatever. The giant mustache Pringle snail. And, uh, whereas this little guy will recover a large amount of magic points, or mana points while summoned, so you never run out of mana, the giant snail will recover a large amount of hit points while summoned. So you never really, unless you get one-shotted, you never run out of health. Oh, someone's talking to me. I'm famous, guys. Oh, oh. Crap, I didn't want to... 
I want to talk, not... <sighs> this is a first. This has never happened to me. Too poor to be dating. Opens up all the windows when I'm trying to type my pickup lines. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna be over here hunting blimps. RP'd. They wish to RP. Shameless plug! I'm sorry, I should not be doing the commentary in text. Here, I need to I need to heal. There we go, that's good. What does that even mean? I n I'm well aware that you can get, you know, married in this game. I'm pretty sure they're just playing around, though, because that's uh, you have to, like, invest actual cash to make that happen. And also, I'm not particularly keen on doing that with a random stranger. Or a friend, or anyone specifically. Very flattering, though. the guy? Did I pass him? Was he on that same map? Did I leave for no reason? I think I left for no reason. Yeah, he's here. Hello, Stefan! He can't see me. I'm a ghost. You don't need to break this all this down, Phantom. Ichabod Crane? 
Oh yeah, I guess he does kinda... He is pretty crany looking. Oh, I need to... I need to flirt with the Nazi whore. I need to go give her the old phantom charm. And uh, the old phantom hepatitis. While I'm at it. Hello, Axe Rev. I don't recognize you. Welcome to the stream. We're not gonna be- I'm not gonna be doing this a whole lot longer. I'm just about- just about wrapped up. I'm kinda running out of commentar commentary for Maple Story. And I already did that. I get, made a lot of progress. I just blew through a bunch of levels and got to a uh, second advancement with Phantom today, so that's good. I'm gonna be... I'll, I'll still go for like a little under half an hour probably and then switch to Awesome Knots. Or soon. A lot of, uh, a lot of blasters. A lot of the new guys here. That guy's just brand new. Where am I going again? Oh, right, I'm going to the Nazi whore. There we go. No? Not her? Who else is it? How long have you played? As in, like, overall or today? Because today I've been going for about hour and a half two hours something like that maybe two and a half hours but overall I've been playing since uh, I've been playing on and off since you know classic maple story with just the four classes just explorers before pirates are introduced before all the story characters and all that so I do, I, I do kind of miss the the old, the old Maple, and I, I I was here to see if the reboot, you know, the whole reboot idea was supposed to make it a little bit more like that, a little more solo oriented, a little simpler, and I don't know. I've been, I haven't really seen a whole lot of difference with the whole re the whole reboot system thus far. Because I haven't gotten to a level where I'm gonna be like visiting the free market or anything like that. Follow your nose to Secretary Letier. Okay, who who is that? Where is she? Uh. Oh, it's in the mine. Okay. So I went the wrong way. I just started this character at the start of the stream today, so, uh... With the burning combined with Phantom's, like, absurdly fast leveling, I've got up to the first advancement in you know, two hours. Mm-mm, just cheesing past all the monsters. They're still waiting for my answer. Oh, there's, there's her again. The, uh, Viking lady. She looks like the like the Viking chick from uh, Rayman. I think it's Rayman. Is it? Uh, no, Spyro Skylanders. I think she's got like a. Uh... No, it is Rayman. I know that she, there's like a redheaded Viking girl who has a trophy in Smash Brothers. I think it's from Rayman. I'm not positive though. I I don't know these. I don't know Rayman. I have a very memorable face. Well, thank you. Also, I, I lost my hair under the hat. I'm just bald under there. When I wear the hat, my hair disappears. Okay, I, I gotta kill some safety first machines. 
Because we, we, we at the Maple Nazis, we don't care about safety. We gotta take care of that. Wong and Chang. Okay. How strong are these guys? Strong! Okay. Nope. Where the- wait. Safety first. Were those the right guys or was those the wrong guys? Say- did she- did she mean the signs outside? Safety first machines. Okay, I think that's what's conf what confused me because I don't think they're machines. They're like slime things. Yeah, these are the ones she's talking about. They don't flinch easy though. Okay, that's just ten of these. That's kind of easy. Whatever, I'm, I'm down. The high, the high avoidability on thieves is nice, though. Even if it is RNG-based. Just being able to not take any damage on a fairly regular basis. There we go. Oh, someone activated the rune. There it goes. Oh, maybe I should wait for that. Can I get that stuff? I want to share the wealth. Okay, I'll get this stuff over here. I'll get this little pile. There we go. I got some things. I just, I'll just mooch off her rune, and then fuck off. They added a lot of... Recently, they've added a lot of, like, random map elements. That I guess are supposed to encourage staying on the same map for a little... Also, I don't have a chair. Why? Does, doesn't the Phantom get a chair? Did I just skip that? Did I miss that? I don't know. I don't have a chair. Oh, I'm gonna have to buy one. God damn it. Also, where'd this come? Okay, I picked up a cane randomly. Yes, that's good. Don't need that. Now, oh, of course, it's female. I only get female clothes. I just I pick up female clothes off the ground and pack off with them. So I'm gonna runes. No, they don't. You mean Phantom doesn't get a chair? You mean? I thought he did. Maybe I'm just... Maybe I'm just full of crap. I'm gonna have to go to, like, Blith Harbor and buy a crappy one, I guess. Okay, this feels like a trap. Are you reboot? Yes, this is in the reboot world. That's what I'm... That's what I'm testing out today. So I just, I came into this room and just killed a bunch of bunnies. I just came in here to commit bunny genocide. I didn't even have to kill the last two, I just did it for the sheer pleasure of it. done in Edelstein. Are we finished here? What's going on? Oh, and I leveled up again.
Yes, I am burning. I'm trying to... I'm basically starting over my main main. Because my highest character was a level 140 Phantom. Was the highest I ever got to. And I wanted to try the reboot world. So, I'm... Try I'm trying to move my main character over to here, see if it's, you know, any better, and starting over another phantom. And I'm getting through it pretty quickly, so we'll see how things go. In what world? In, uh, Reboot. Oh, and in, in the original one? I th I actually- I'm actually not sure. I think he was in Kiney. Kaney. Person. Place. K-H-A-I-N-I. Okay, so now we gotta get the information together. Oh, and I got a new, uh, I got a new thing. Level 25, okay. They, they are severely underestimating my level. Well, I'll have that when I'm level 40 at least. I can teach you how to level. Oh, I know, I'm sure, I know, know how to, le I know the faster way to level is to actually grind, but that's not... Not exactly fun to play, and it's certainly not fun to stream, so I'm not going to be doing that, but I appreciate it. I'm going to... I'm actually going to call it for now. So, I've got one quest string done, and I got a first job advancement. So, we'll, uh, we'll maybe come back to this. I'm probably going to play... I'm going to be playing some of this off stream, obviously. So, uh, I got I to gotta start on the, re on the reboot world. We'll see how things play out. And I'm going to be switching over to some Awesome Knots. So, I'll be right back in just a few minutes. Stick around. <laughs> 